light of today's volatile financial markets, it's more important than ever to know that your portfolio is being properly managed. But how do you know if your financial advisor is doing the right job for you? Well, here are five questions you can ask that will give you some great insights into how your money or your portfolio is actually being managed. The so first question you might ask is, does your money manager opportunistically change the asset allocation of your portfolio, or do they stick to some fixed mix strategic allocation? That means, do the percentages that you own in stocks and bonds stay the same, or do they change as the market conditions change? It's difficult for consumers today because most money managers claim to be active. But if your money manager is changing the asset allocation, that's a different kind of risk management than just rebalancing the fixed percentages. Make sure you understand the difference. A second question you might ask is whether the firm's investment objective is to outperform a benchmark or are they trying to earn absolute returns? Both methods have their place. Oftentimes, a close look at a firm's track record would reveal that they made money in just one small bear market or one small bull market, and they don't do as well in all of the other market periods. How consistent the firm is in earning returns is crucially important. A third question is, does the firm conform to the GIPS performance standards? GIPS means Global Investment Performance Standards. Firms can be pretty tricky when presenting you with their historic performance. They might be showing you hypothetical, back-tested performance that wasn't actually earned in real time. Other firms will say that they only do customized portfolios and not have any track record at all. So make sure you know the difference. You want to find a firm with a real track record. You want to find that track record with the analysts that actually produce that record. And you want them to conform to the highest standards of presenting performance. A fourth question that you can ask is, does a firm make large market timing bets when they're managing money? So if a firm is going to take your portfolio to 100% cash, that implies, of course, that they know when there's a bear market and they'll know when to get back into the market at a bull market, which is fine if they can do it. If your firm is going to make a big bet, just know that comes typically with bigger risks. Finally, how does this firm make investment decisions? Do they rely on quantitative or mathematical models to make their decisions? Or do they rely on qualitative judgment calls in making their decisions? There are a lot of good questions to ask a money manager, and these five questions just get you started. But try to be a good consumer of money management services. Take your time, interview more than one manager, Make sure that this is a relationship that you can live with for a long period of time.